Hello welcome to the curious head sign up and leave the like. Once a human being is confirmed dead, their body begins to slowly decompose as their cells wither and bacteria take over. However, do you know exactly how long it takes for a corpse to completely decompose? Although the decomposition process begins minutes after the death of an individual, there are a number of things that influence this stage, such as ambient temperature, soil acidity, coffin material, or even some embalming ritual performed previously. Understand more about it. On average, a person who has been buried in a typical wooden coffin begins to decompose within a year, but it takes up to a decade for it to completely decompose, leaving only their skeleton. If that individual had been buried without a coffin, however, things tend to happen faster. A corpse buried in the ground, without any kind of protection against insects or other elements, is usually skeletonized in five years. In that sense, the breakdown process is pretty straightforward, with cells dying as soon as oxygenated blood stops flowing through the veins. It is in this phase that we can see autolysis, which occurs when the body's cells release digestive enzymes, especially those from lysosomes, which break down the cells themselves, in addition to other carbohydrates and proteins. Putrefaction, or the decomposition of organic matter without oxygen by bacteria, fungi, or other organisms, often turns some parts of the skin green about 18 hours after death. At the same time that the human body is breaking down from the inside, the bacteria in the abdomen multiply rapidly, creating gases that make the body bloat and smell bad, something that is even more accelerated when the body is in a hot environment. For this reason, human remains are usually kept in the refrigerator until burial. During this stage of swelling, the skin may slip and form some blisters. Eventually, the swelling collapses and a new process called black putrefaction begins. When the body's organs and tissues soften and life forms such as insects and microbes eat the remaining soft tissue. To slow the decomposition of a dead body, embalmers have developed techniques to drain blood and other fluids from a dead body, replacing them with other chemicals that will be injected into the veins. Preservatives stop the bacterial activity that breaks down the body. Deadly remains that go through this type of process can take decades to decompose, the mummies of ancient Egypt being the greatest examples of this. All this, however, also depends on the coffin not suffering any kind of damage. After all, coffins buried in acidic soils erode more quickly, exposing the body to the elements of nature, including insects, which favor the decomposition process. Until the next video with more curiosities.